YouTube is coming with even more censorship restrictions on June 1st, 2021. And they've already have made disappear hundreds of my videos of mine, about 30 serious two-hour historical documentaries and my entire channel Gure with eight years of work. It was my present to humanity and for our children. And now it's all gone forever. As the Swiss Nazi Templar police stole all my hard disks, uh, backup, backups, DVDs, USB sticks, computers, video cameras, memory cards, you name it. So I've been looking for years for a substitute video platform in the internet. And the last days I've been searching quite intensively. So I found Brateon video platform using real servers and no P2P, peer-to-peer blockchain and it looked good so i thought well okay this is it i'm going to make my youtube substitute and go on making videos so i tried to create an account and then this happened someone already using my email address not possible to create a brighteon account here it says email already exists here's my email i you know and uh, this I had already heard by people warning me that others use my email to collect money for themselves on other platforms with the videos I made getting money for the work I did. How do these cyber criminals do that? And how can they use my email? How is it the same email can be used twice? How can they get my mails? It all gives me a headache and I can't wrap my head around all the informatics technology. Watch this video here in my same channel here. Then the most unexpected, unbelievable thing happened. And it is indeed the unexpected that changes our lives. It was Shai from Israel on the phone telling me that he had made his own video hosting platform with a few friends after YouTube deleted all his channels. So people, how come YouTube deleted a jaywalker, all his channels and videos, when so many people say that YouTube is in fact jaywalker tube? Look, even Amazon is selling these t-shirts. Here you can see Amazon. <laughs> All of that is just Nazi and Islamofascist disinformation who spread dangerous lies against the jaywalkers, like the good old continuous Nazi propaganda from Octagon out of their neutral Alps. And this uh, Nazi propaganda is most, mostly dangerous for us because we will miss out the real enemy. So Shai told me they made me my own channel in his video platform, which I chose by the name of my first and by YouTube deleted channel, Gure. So this is the name of the channel here, Gure. Already got 737 videos on it. I made more than 1000. Uh, already this has been rescued. And Live 5 to 8 is the name of the video platform. The new Gure is an abbreviation for G-I-U-R-E-H, Group for International United Rescue of Earth and Humanity, which is a hardcore military organization with tactical units. So if anyone wants to join in 3D, we're based in a mountainous area in France for now. The Gure, the Gure Human Liberation Front, Time is short, so all real warriors team up with me. This Gure group has nothing to do with Israel or the Jaywalkers. It's my group in Europe and they are my videos. I just needed a new video platform and good old Chai stretched out his helping hand. And if that would have been a German or American who would have done that first at that very moment, then I would have taken their helping hand. Shai and his mates are info warriors like us all here, who want the truth out. Shai wants freedom of speech, which I hope he will also offer for little misled neo-Nazis so we can help them. And Shai wants a free world for his children. 
Here you can see Shai Donan. So Shai is a real revolutionary here playing Indian classic music with the Sanskrit letters in the back. I call him Shai Guevara. They even look alike. Who knows? Be aware, Pharaoh Nazi Templars. Shai Guevara is coming for you. So anyone who wants to get a message of my new videos, create an account here at Ahava528 and subscribe to the Resurrection of Gure. So to find the website, you just punch in live.ahava528 and it will, it will pop out. Ahava means love in Hebrew and 528 is 528 hertz. And apparently the frequency of love. Well, don't ask me how that works. Personally, I believe we need the frequency of hatred towards the enemy of mankind. I don't believe in the Ten Commandments, as good old Shai does, while our, masters, while our masters are killing us by the millions, and where the lie is their foremost biggest weapon of Pharaoh and their worldwide aristocracy based in their neutral base. On Shai's Frequency of Love site, you can even download an app application for your Android or cell phone. I'll explain you how it works, if I remember. <laughs> so I, I, I wrote this in the, the browser of my computer. And then it says here, configure your app, install the app. How download app on Ahava 528. So you probably uh find that a lot easier than i do i've um yeah well so if you have punched this like in the browser the general browser life i have a 528.com you scroll down and you get this one here where you can ask any question and here is a um so this is the front page of the live 528 where all the videos are. And this one here is the main menu where there's a lot of interesting uh, options. So when you're in the site, the video platform, after you have searched this here, the live Ahava, then you go here on top here and search and you write Curie, the name of my channel, like this. And then I will pop out my channel. It will pop up. I'm sorry, not the channel will pop up. So you, you know, if you do a search for Gure, then all the videos, they'll pop up. And uh, then you uh, click on uh, Gure, like this here. And then the, uh, the whole channel will come. So here's the channel. And uh, in the channel, you can find uh, like all the videos and then at the top right of this uh, in the channel or in the site, you got all this, this here. And of course, you know, we don't understand all this here. Uh, but the site is good. It works like YouTube, actually. And they say even better some things. So you punch here. Here are the, the flags. Uh, let's go look for something English or oh, even, even Turkish here. There we go. There it is. I'm sorry about the UK or Australia. It only has a, an American flag. And punch here. And look, now it says here search and sign in. It's all in English. Quite handy. Oh, yeah. And, you know, after you searched for Gure and you get this here. So instead of clicking here, what I just did, you can also click here on this one here. We're next to Gure. And here also you get the whole channel. Should be coming now. Yeah, well, there it is. That's another way. Shai had been asking me for a long time, and here was the first interview we did in September 2020, which was quite special for me too. Very special energy came over me when doing this. The title, A Straight Talk with Sean Ross 1. Shai had our interview on YouTube before, before with thousands of views, which YouTube erased. 
From the moment on Shai did this interview with me, things started going bad for him. <laughs> I guess our masters don't like it very much, me explaining the Jaywalker tribes about the Templar rule out of Swaziland and Pharaoh still in total power over the Holy Land and elsewhere over the other tribes of this world, including the northern tribes of the, the so-called warrior tribes of Germania, the Slavic tribes and the Celtic tribes. We're all tribesmen and slaves of Pharaoh in a worldwide feudal aristocratic rulership. The interview had quite an impact on Shai, so he edited it with pictures and Jay Walker subtitles, which you can see here. The title is Connecting Some Dots with Sean Ross, number two. Then a couple of days back in May 2021, we did this interview with Rabbi Dov Berkowitz and Sean Ross asking the rabbi some pertinent unorthodox questions like why God didn't know about the European peoples or the Asians as the holy books of the Middle East stopped at the Mediterranean to the north, to the west it stopped at the Libyan desert and to the east God's world stopped in Mesopotamia, nowadays Turkey. I don't see really why the northern race of Europeans actually adopted the Bible as we don't even exist for God or any other holy books. Therefore, when some of the jaywalkers talk bad about the Goy in the Babylonian Talmud, they, don't, they can't possibly mean us whiteys by that, as at that time they didn't even know we existed. So dear neo-Nazis, don't get angry at the jaywalkers when you read about what they say about the Goy because they don't mean you with it, nor your white race. It's also happened to be my race. Oh, never mind. Dear Roseanne, my sister, if you're also tired of YouTube commercials of Pharaoh's companies and their Nazi censorship, and you'd like to come back to the roots of your tribe in Israel, then just contact me and I'll ask Shai, Eitan, and the other freedom of speech loving guys around this video platform and I'm sure they'll make you your own video channel as they did for me too. And here is another interview Shai and me did last year 2020 entitled Hatred of Evil a High Form of Love with Sean Ross. So in Shai's video platform The Frequency of Love there's my new Gure channel with the frequency of war because the hatred of evil is the highest form of love. <laughs>